Dear ones, this is a time of intense change, recalibration and realignment. This time is a time known as the awakening. The awakening is a great gift for humanity as it brings into focus those things, those people and those mindsets which no longer serve you. Those policies, agendas, traditions, rules, regulations that no longer serve you. It is a time where we are now bringing into sharp focus those people, those policies, those values that ultimately add value and those pseudo protective structures that now seem also elusive in their integrity. Now is the time to join with others in heart and mind. What are the core values that create peace and happiness? What are the core values that bring humanity together and heal divides? No longer is race, politics, wealth, status, academia of value in a world with so much dramatic change and restructuring. Restructuring, not just in the external world, but within every cell of each body that breathes, within each cell of every conscious being, plant, animal and soul. This restructuring is creating a wave of change in thought and emotional energy all over the globe which is reverberating far and wide into the cosmos. Many benevolent beings of light are now gathering all around. Angels, masters and galactic beings of light. They form a shield of love all around the planet which helps to anchor every wave and vibration of love into the very fabric of earth to its deepest core. You will feel a purging as this light purifies everything that is no longer aligned with a fifth dimensional existence. We are moving rapidly towards a golden age and everything that is no longer pure, which no longer serves, which does not represent integrity, it will be purged. The cellular structure of the planet is realigning. Its networks of ley lines and energetic poles are shifting and as living breathing matter, our physical bodies, our minds and subconscious patterns of being are all becoming realigned so that they correspond and run in harmony with the earth's resonance. As breathing living matter this will create a purging on deeper and deeper levels as many things come up to be healed and released, including ancestral karma in our lineage and even further afield. All that doesn't resonate with 5D is now going to become extinct old paradigms will no longer hold any sway as swathes of mass change now envelop the whole of humanity. 
The light is bright now, dear ones, but be ready to be dazzled. This is only part of what is ahead for all of us. We all have our part to play. Firstly, we need to release everything that no longer serves the new and emerging pattern of our new life on earth. The longer you try to hold on to the old, the more difficult this process of adjustment will be. The way forward is to release how your life used to look, physically, emotionally, financially and spiritually. Those old paradigms are not returning. Many new things are now ahead of us as a collective. The focus now, dear ones, must be towards loving thy neighbour, towards healing all dark forces within and without. Many revelations are ahead of us as a collective, things which will rip through those who are trying to still hold on to the now outdated notions of success of community, of self-worth. These old paradigms for happiness were actually shackles, attachments. They were the rat race. God did not create this beautiful universe for anyone to be shackled to attachments to the rat race. This is now an urgent message for all. If you want to transition to the new world with ease, peace and joy in your heart, then realise that what has been normal up until this point has actually all been an illusion of ego. It has not been a paradigm of success. A paradigm of success is a world that bases its wealth of transactions on the currency of love. Not assets, not stock, not shares, not accolades, but love. Once this realisation is truly understood, then the doors to heaven will open Huge doors will open to reveal this majestic world of light and vibrancy where colour, smell, touch, taste and sound will all be in technicolour. As the doors open, heaven will be revealed to all those willing to step through, leaving ego behind and embracing the notion of love as the international currency for all nations, all creeds, all of humanity. This vision is already a reality for those who have solidly undertaken the spiritual work and they are now leading everyone forward. Do not label the seeming unknown as good or bad. Instead, close your eyes, connect to your heart. What does your intuition lead you to do? Then without logical critical analysis, just make the leap of faith. Try another way. It will feel uncomfortable you will need to retrain every fibre of your being. But retrain every fibre you must if you want to step through the doors to heaven victorious. Now is your time. Release the status quo. There is no going back to normal. There is only going forward to heaven on earth. Love is the new currency, embrace it. 
This has been a channeling by Sanat Kumara.